Hello! Hi everybody, it's me, Modji, and I want to wish you guys good morning, good evening, good afternoon, whatever time it is, whatever area of the world you're in, and uh, welcome to the live stream. Today we're going to be doing some Pictionary. I'm going to be drawing some uh, very famous and maybe some less famous old school RuneScape items, and you guys are going to be guessing what they are using QuizKit. Now, just a few little announcements before we get started. The first one is that this is just like a fun, casual live stream. Uh, we still have the Q&A, that's still on Wednesday, so don't panic. We will still be aing your cues when we get to Wednesday. Um, the other is that this is kind of a bit of a test drive, so if we have a few hiccups, please be patient and bear with us, because as I said, this is just sort of a fun little lecture for you guys. Um, just uh, maybe brighten your Monday, we'll see. Um, also, if you want to get involved using the quiz kit, please can you make sure that you uh, enable quiz kit to use your username for the leaderboard. And I'll come to why that's a bit important in a minute. But in order to enable quiz kit, you have to go to the um, top right corner of your screen. The quiz kit thing is somewhere on the right of your screen. And if you click that, then you can enable quiz kit to use your username for the leaderboard. Why would you want to be on the leaderboard, you ask? Why would you like your username to be used, you ask? prizes guys there's going to be some prizes so for each drawing that we do some uh, answers will appear via quiz kit you answer as quickly as you can the quicker you answer the more points you get right so the quickest person to answer correctly will get the most amount of points and they will appear at the top of the leaderboard anybody who comes in uh, first to uh, in tenth to second place will receive seven days membership for free Anybody who comes first, and that could be a couple of you if you get the same amount of points, you will receive one month of membership for free. So uh, let's have a little look at the chat. Have you guys managed to... Why did I look at the chat? <laughs> have you guys managed to enable your usernames yet? Um, I'll give you a little demo in the meantime. Um, so for example, if I was to draw the iconic sword from the logo, it will appear on your screens something like this. And you'll have 30 seconds to pick your answer before we go to the answers. Gotcha. Uh, I'll have to draw slightly lower than that. But you get the idea, I get the idea. Where? Uh... Cool. So um, there's going to be a series of 20 questions, 20 drawings, and um, the fastest person to click the answer gets the most points. Cool. So I guess if we're ready, should we get started? Cool. Right, so um, if you're just joining us, make sure that you enable QuizKit to use your username because otherwise we won't be able to know if you are a winner. Oh, cool. All right, wait, what am I seeing? Wait, where did it Oh, we're starting, we're starting! I'm so sorry. <laughs> right, okay. Wait, we're gonna restart the first one. Sorry, guys. <laughs> like I said. <laughs> Alright. Alright, wait, do we, are we restarting the quiz kit? I think we're restarting the quiz kit and we're gonna have another go. <laughs> I have some little helpers behind the scene. I have Mod Spear, Mod Apon, and Mod Tide helping with this. <laughs> All right, uh, shall I start drawing the first image now? Okay. <laughs> okay, cool. Well, in the meantime, let's uh, chat about our days. How are you guys doing? <laughs> I'll put this back up. <laughs> so um, I'll just again say once again, if you're joining us, we have 6,000 people watching. That's incredible. If you're just joining us, make sure that you enable QuizKit to use your username because we don't want to see any anons on the leaderboard because that will make it very tricky to find out who to give our prizes to. So enable your username by clicking on the right hand side of your screen and letting QuizKit use your username. All right. Shall I start drawing the first one? <laughs> We're uh, just reopening quiz kit right now. <laughs> Sorry guys. But um, it's going to be quiz kit. Is that going to do anything? Not too sure. Quiz kit, quiz kit, quiz kit. <laughs> Try 
and look for somebody to say something other than exclamation point quiz kit. <laughs> How do you answer? Okay, so what's going to happen is four answers are going to come up, four possible answers, and you're going to click the one that you think it is. <laughs> exclamation point quiz knows, not that quiz, unfortunately. <laughs> it's working? Okay, good stuff. I'm loving the little Juno charges in the chat. <laughs> Anyone with Juno charge? <laughs> I see. <laughs> okay, cool. So, right. Take two. Shall I start drawing? Background, person in my ear, I'm drawing. Let's go. Ooh. These are not going to be my finest drawings, I'll warn you. We're going for speed over beauty. <laughs> right, are we ready to answer? <laughs> are we ready for answers? Oh, people are already answering. Cool, cool, cool. Right, get your answers in. What do you think it is? How fast can you be? Oh my gosh, so much stress for a month of membership potentially. You guys could do it, I believe in you. <laughs> All right, what do we think the answer is? The great reveal, mod acorn, if you will. <laughs> and it is, of course, bones. And how many of you guessed that correct? 1300 of you guessed it was Bones! I'm very disappointed in the couple of you. <laughs> Wait, let's open this up. 700 got Ogre Bones. Oh no, I'm so sorry guys! Did it look a bit too much like Ogre Bones? Alright, okay. Well, how does the leaderboard look? Do we get to see the leaderboard now? Oh, there we go! Right, so we have... Oh, I can't, it's so small. Let me make this big. Right, top of the leaderboard, we have Riada TV. Congratulations, Riada, you're currently in the number one spot. Number two spot, we have Bread. Oh god, you're all joint! Oh my gosh, because uh, it's only the first question. You guys must have all been absolutely on the money it's so ridiculously fast, it's insane. Okay, now... Okay, wait, um, I'm gonna just take two seconds because I had to like open that really wide. Right, next drawing, coming up. Are you ready? Any minute now. Maybe you guys can guess based on uh, what colour we have. Right, what could it be? What could it be? <laughs> Again, not my finest drawings in the world, I hope you guys will forgive me. But I'm on your side, I'm just trying to help you guess what it could possibly be. Oh, I think it's a bit darker than that. All right, have we got guesses? What do you think it is? Get your guesses in. Guess what this absolutely terrible drawing could possibly be. Okay, the points are going down, 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 down to zero. What did you guess? Results. And the answer is... Abyssal Whip! <laughs> Congratulations to anybody who got that one correct. We had 2,005 people guess that one correct. We had 162 guess Abyssal Tentacle, unlucky to you guys. But let's see what that does to our leaderboard. <laughs> I clear the way for the next drawing. So our leaderboard is looking like, oh, we've got a shift. We have. It looks like nearly all new people in... Oh, so the, for the question stores, have we got any new faces in the top three? We still have Riada TV in the number one spot. But just edging ahead of Dubchi, we have Infrared Pen coming in third. Wow, you guys are really close. Jorby44 in fourth place and Fake Nuff in fifth. Wow, this is tight, guys. Right, let's see how we go along to the third drawing. Ready? 
You guys can't see which colour I'm picking, so I think that maybe you're at a disadvantage. But let's see how we do. Wow, these drawings are just getting better and better, I think. <laughs> Absolutely shocking display. But uh, I'm on the clock as much as you guys are, so I hope you can possibly forgive me. <laughs> right, let's just fill that. Ooh. What could it be? What could it be? Right, you guys are guessing. Most Remember, the most points are for the quickest guesses. Oh. So make sure you get your guesses in nice and quick. To be in with a chance of winning the free membership. Okay. Right. Zero. We're down to zero points. So I think it's time for us to reveal the answer. What do you think it is? What could it possibly be? Little tiny drum roll. <laughs> it's the Amulet of Fury! Congratulations if you got that right. Commiserations if you got it wrong. Let's see what it does to our leaderboard. How are we doing? Right, so I imagine that our top... How are our top four looking? Did anybody not get that? 1,700 of you did get that right. So, in, so for the question, we had T, T Monet's came first out of the question and has launched himself into third place. That's some incredible work. And it looks like we've got a whole new set for our top five on the leaderboard. That's amazing stuff. Yerdi, congratulations. Con con uh, contestant number 2423, congratulations, dude. You're in second place. Team on A's coming in with that, with that number one. And uh, NBA season in with a new spot at number five. Right, well. Let's move along to our fourth drawing, I believe. I'm gonna lose track of what number drawing we're on. All right, let's go. What could this one be? <laughs> I'll be absolutely shocked if anyone gets this absolutely beautiful drawing wrong. What could it be, guys? Do you have any idea what this could possibly be? <laughs> and get your answers in! While I complete this, uh... Should we call it a monstrosity? Let's call it a monstrosity. <laughs> right. Points going down, points going down. Remember, the earlier you get your answer in, the more points you get the more likely you are of winning some free membership. So uh, let's see what the answer is to this one. What could it possibly be? Let's check it out. It was the Kraken, of course it was the Kraken. 13,070, no, 13, <laughs> 1,374 of you getting that one right. Congratulations to you guys. 706 of you getting it slightly wrong. Oh, if, um, if you're typing your answers in chat, uh, unfortunately you're not going to be getting any points for that. You have to make sure that you enable QuizKit to use your Twitch, so that's on the right hand side of this screen. Make sure that you click your QuizKit. Don't worry, we're only on question 4, I think, out of about 20 total questions. So even if you haven't been using your QuizKit just yet, don't worry. If you enable it right now by going to the right hand corner of your screen, you will probably be able to launch your way into first place with a few of the more tricky drawings that we come to later on. So how has that affected our scores? We have Yerdi in number one space, Riata TV coming back, absolutely clawing his way back into second place, contestant 3,283, I think that's a new contestant there, into third place, and we've got a few new names including Rushy Rules and Tohi Gi for you. Congratulations to you guys. You've made your way onto the leaderboard. Let's see if you can keep your positions. Right, moving on. We unfortunately don't have an exclamation point quiz kit command. You do have to click it. It's on the right hand corner of the screen. Make sure that you click that. Don't exclamation point quiz kit. That doesn't really do anything. <laughs> so go to the screen, click quiz kit, and um, get involved. Make sure that you're make sure that you're getting your guesses in. And if you're typing in chat, that's not going to register either. You have to click one of the four options that comes up 
after we've started drawing. So if you're not clicking, you're not getting points. Let's go on to the fifth drawing. Let's go. What could this be? What could it be, guys? I'm going to give you some of the most important information first. What could it be? Big spoilers here. Big spoilers coming in. What could possibly have a lovely green tip? Get your answers in. Make sure you make sure you're sure because if you're not sure, I don't know, you could miss out. You could miss out. So what do you reckon? Dragon Dagger? Dragon Dagger? Dragon Dagger? Dragon Defender. Check it out. What do you think it is? <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm just gonna like you know, pretty up the drawing in the meantime. Zero points, Kate. So we're gonna get the results in. Let's see how many of you picked the correct answer. Tiny drum roll. What have we got? It was of course. The poison dragon, the poison dragon dagger. Congratulations to the 1,753 of you that got that correct. You guys really know your stuff. We've got some real strong answers in this round. Um, 105 of you guessed dragon dagger. 310 of you guessed the superior dragon dagger. That's unfortunate for you guys. But let's see what that does to our leaderboard. So for this particular question, we had hey we. Hey are we getting in the number one spot? But does that launch hey are we onto the overall leaderboard? Unfortunately not. We have contestant 3,283 coming from third place into first place. Congratulations to you. We have Irask, which I think is a new name. We hopefully back. Unfortunately, we had a bit of a um, um, network issue with our internet provider. The internet provider that I am on, the internet provider that the mods are on, and basically the whole of Cambridge. So we had a little bit of problem with that, but we're back now, and we can carry on with our Pictionary. I've got my little helper, Juno. Say hello, Juno. <laughs> and she's probably just going to sleep behind me, so there you go, June. Have a nice time. Um, I don't know if you guys remember where we were at, but we just drew a, a um, poison dragon dagger. And we're uh, going to be moving on to the, I believe it's the sixth drawing. If you're just joining us, or if you haven't managed to get your quiz kit connected, don't worry, you probably now have a better chance than ever of winning one of the two top prizes, which could be one, uh, what is it, one week of free membership or one month of free membership. So make sure that you enable your quiz kit on the right hand side of the screen. Uh, there's no exclamation point quiz kit, there's no typing in chat, it's all done through clicking the answers when they appear. So make sure that you have that enabled. And without further ado, I think we'll get back into the Pictionary itself. So let's draw our sixth item. Am I good to go, mods in the background? Okay, let's see, what could this possibly be? Oh, have I got the right color? That's more like it, I think. Right, what could this be? Remember, the quicker you get your answers in, the more points you get. But if you get the wrong answer, it's no points whatsoever. We got that little one down there. Oh wow, this is probably our dodgiest drawing yet. So if you get this right, I'll be so proud of you guys. <laughs> and the answers are coming up. And now I believe, what do you think this could possibly be? I think the color probably gives it away more than anything. And you guys are actually pretty lucky to be honest, because this is a pretty shocking drawing. <laughs> So if you get this, it's some points. And you know what points mean? Potential membership. Right, so I think we have uh, finished this absolutely terrible drawing. Somebody in the chat put horrible, I couldn't agree more. This is really, really bad. Uh, but uh, we're back, so I'm just fairly happy about that. Let's reveal the answer. It was, of course, coins. 975 of you got that right. It seems like we've had a big dip in players. So whoever is left, you've got a better chance of winning the membership. And let's see uh, what that does to our leaderboards. I think it could really shake things up. So the uh, the best answers came from, oh gosh, it's so small now. Tohig for you has absolutely launched himself from fifth place, absolutely capitalized on the DC all the way up to first place. Congratulations, Tohig for you. And Len in second. And other than that, we have a whole new top scores. We have Clevitar. Hamsterbachi and we have lolcats. 
X C. Congratulations to you guys. You're currently in the top five spots, but can you stay there? Let's see. Moving into our seventh drawing. Now, I think these drawings are going to get slightly harder. So uh, let let me just like wiggle my hands a little bit. Uh, I think I'm good to start drawing. So let's just go for it. Right. What could this be? If you want to get your hands on that membership, make sure that you're you're answering as quickly as possible. And the answers are up now. But remember, if you guess incorrectly, you could miss out on the chance to get points altogether. What do you think it could be? Right, points are counting down. Make sure you get your points in. I don't know how to do these details, so I'm just going to suggest it. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Can I only apologise? Right, so down to zero points. Should we find out what our answer was? Mod, mod, mod icon, reveal it. And the answer was, of course, the dragon chain body. Congratulations to the 916 of you who got that right. Unfortunately, it was not the dragon plate body. I'm so sorry to 314 of you. But let's see what that does to our leaderboard. So the best scores for this answer came from... Are you snoring, Jim? Uh, Wultar with the first place. But do, does Wultar, has Wultar done enough to make it onto the board? Unfortunately not. But not far off from our top players. Enlen in number one spot. And we've we've lost Tohik for you. Unfortunately off the top five altogether. Um, Hamster Bachi coming in number two. Wow. This is... I mean, it's all to play for, isn't it, guys? Should we move along to our eighth drawing? So, um... Right. What do you reckon this could be? Oh, that's slightly wrong colour. What would you do with that membership if you won it? Let me know in chat. <laughs> and distract you from answering. Oh, this one's hard, you know. So the questions are coming in now. What do you think it is? Answer via quiz kit. Don't answer in chat. It's not going to do anything. Answer via quiz kit. This is a, a beautiful interpretation, I think. And I'll just draw a little arrow of movement there, just to give you a few more, a few more clues if you hadn't got it already. There might be some movement that we can't see in a still Pictionary drawing. So all the way down to zero points, but who got it right and who got it wrong? Let us reveal the correct answer. It was, of course, the fire cape. A whopping 1,184 of you getting that right. Proud of you guys. You really pulled it back on this one. So um, without further ado, let's see what that does to our scores. Who could it be? So the top answers for that question came from contestant number 2731. If you could enable your username, that would be great. Thank you so much, contestant 7481. But of course, our top spots are still, they're still looking pretty similar. We have Hamster Batchy and Enlen pretty much neck and neck for the top spot there. In fact, exactly neck and neck. So um, that'll be interesting to see. Uh, Walt Walkaz coming in third, Brunton, I'm not sure we've seen you in the top, and we have Clev Clevista, sorry if I absolutely butcher your username, it's really small and a bit far away, uh, Clevitar is coming in number fifth, and I believe we've seen you on the top spot before, so let's see if you can stay this time, Clevitar. Moving on to our ninth drawing. Ready, guys? Right, I'll be absolutely shocked if you don't guess this one just by the colour. Because I have nailed that colour. First try. <laughs> Alright, answers are coming in now. What do you think it could possibly be? Bow, 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 bow.
Oh no. <laughs> I like this one. This is my favorite one, yeah, I think. What do you guys think? <laughs> when I'm drawing characters like this, I have to struggle not to pull the face. Alright, we're down to zero points. I'm just getting carried away with the drawing. What is this? Pictionary or mod G streams? <laughs> right, let's reveal the answers. Coming in, what do you think it is? It was, of course, a goblin. A goblin. And um, congratulations to the 1,193 of you that got that right. Very proud of you guys. Uh, 58 of you guessing it was General Grado. Sorry about that. It was not General Grado. It was, of course, one of our famous little lumberish companions, a goblin. Now let's see what that does to our top scores, scores on the doors. How are we looking? So the top answers for that question came from Co Bo Bean 243. Well done, guys. Um, but the top spot, Enlen, has taken once again from Hamster Batchy. Wolkaz coming up to third place, Brunton coming up to fourth place, and you know what? I think that looks almost exactly the same as it did. Just a few switcheroos for our top five players. But um, let's see if anybody can challenge those guys. Maybe we'll see some new game, some new names in after this drawing. Right, I'm gonna take it away if that's all good. Oh, this one's really hard. Okay. Here we go. What could it be? You know, these are just gonna get harder as well, so uh, if you haven't started playing yet, you might wanna consider it. Because you could come in at the last minute, sweep a couple of questions, and take that top spot. But who do you think this could be? <laughs> these are obviously not my finest drawings in the world, but hopefully you'll be able to, um, You'll be able to guess who this is. Remember, if you're not too sure, it might be a better idea to hold off until you are, because um, you uh, you can't get any points for guessing it wrong. And now the final detail, just to make it extra clear who this is. Right. Who do you think it is? Let's get the answers in. Uh, so, of course, it was the wise old man. Congratulations to the 1,142 of you that got that right. Um, we're going to see what that does to our scores on the doors. If you're just joining us, I'm Mod G. We're doing Pictionary, and you can get involved by clicking the quiz kit, quiz kit on the right hand side of your screen. So, the top answer for that question came from R. Our Symbos, oh, I'm so sorry, that's so hard to, whoa, is that with a perfect 2,000 score? Amazingly done. But we still have Enlem and Hamster Batchy neck and neck. They're just finding out for those top, for that top spot for that one month of free membership. Wolkaz is still there. We have The Liberate, that looks like a new name. I think we've lost, have we lost the bat, the, the Batchy? Was that the name? The bot? But we'll see if that person comes back. So let's see how we do in this next round with our, I believe this might be our 11th or our 10th drawing. I don't have these numbered. But without further ado, I do, I do. Without further ado, here we go. Now this one's absolutely iconic, obviously. I mean, they all are. But I feel like I could just give you that. But I'm not going to, I'm not that cruel. What could it be? <laughs> right, here come the answers. Incoming. If you already know what it is, make sure you get your answer in nice and quickly because that's how you get the most points for those speedy, speedy answers. So, what do you think it is? Don't dilly dally, don't dally your dillies. Answer the question. So we have the points going down. I'll add a few more details for those of you who might still be slightly confused. Some stripes. I don't know if that's going to give it away for anybody in particular. And the answer is, of course, going to be revealed by Mod Acorn in any second mini drum roll. It was the Twisted Bow. Congratulations. 
1,229 of you that got that correct. I think Juno's particularly interested to see what that does to our scores on the doors. Take it away. Mini drum roll. So we have Soup answering the quickest on that one, followed by Lolcats, who we have seen in our top five spot, but not currently. Enlen still clinging on to number one spot, Hamsterbatchy coming in number two, Wolkaz number three, and Clevitar in number four. We have the Liberate sticking around at number five. Those are some familiar names, but can you make it to the top fifth spot? The only way to do it is to answer the correct answer as quickly as possible. So let's move on to our next drawing and um, see if you make it. Right, this one's quite easy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it a little bit harder and I'm going to give you the shape first. Here come the answers. Could you chance it and get it right? Or will you wait to find out what it is? Oh wait, <laughs> it doesn't even have the colour or the answers. This one's really easy. I'm going to be disappointed if anybody gets this wrong, to be honest with you. Don't even have anything left to do. Well, let's w watch those uh, points tick down. 4,000 points if you answer now, 3,000 if you answer now, and absolutely zero if you answer by now. Now let's see what the answer is. I think I will be absolutely shocked if anybody guessed Santa hat. 27 of you guessed Santa hat. So disappointed. Come on, guys, up your ideas. 1,217 guessing absolutely correctly, which was, of course, a party hat. Right, let's see what that does to our scores. Do we have any new names in the top five? Who have we got? So, Codfish007 answering with a perfect score of 20,000 for that question. Insane work, Codfish007. But we still have Enlen in number one spot. We have two new names on our top five leaderboard. Congratulations to Elysian Error and Peridot. You guys sneaking in there. Could you challenge our top two? Could you claw your way up for a chance of that one month membership? Well, let's see. Let's take it away to the potentially 12th, potentially 13th drawing. Alrighty, I believe I'm good to just start drawing, so I will. Oh, a bit lower maybe. What could this be? Can you recognise the iconic shape from here? Or are you going to need a couple more seconds? Answers are being revealed now. But will you get it? I think, I think um, this is another one where I'll be, I'll be surprised. It's counting down, if you still don't know, here's a little eye, and here's another little eye, and here's a few little spikes. <laughs> here's some little, here's some little teeth, and here's some little toesies. But we're at zero points, so let's reveal the answer. Mordacon, if you will, take it away. It was, of course, Jad. Congratulations to anybody who guessed the correct Jad, and um, apologies to anybody who guessed the incorrect Jad. Now let's see that what that does to our scores on the doors. Take it away, Scoremeister. And also, anybody who's roasting me in chat, try and draw something in less than five seconds. It's really hard. <laughs> I didn't realise how hard it was going to be to get a semi-decent drawing out. Voltar in the number one spot. Congratulations, Voltar. But has that put you on the leaderboard? Unfortunately not. Maybe next time. Um, so we have Hamsterbachi at the number one spot. Ellen has disappeared. This is shocking. I did not think that we would see an upset like this in Pictionary this week. Incredible. Peridot launching himself from fifth place all the way to second place. This is, to be honest, this is the most shocked I've been all game. This is an absolute upset of the leaderboard. We have a few new names. Well, we have Brunton back. Our new names include Hapster Hap and PDT23. Congratulations to you guys. You've made your way onto the username. That was question 12, and we are moving on to question 13. Unlucky for some. Let's see how you do. 
Let's see if anybody else can claw their way onto this leaderboard. It's been proven, guys. It's everything to play for. You, you have to be in it to win it. Um, and there are people just coming from absolutely nowhere, so I'm going to take it away. Let's see if you can guess what this absolutely incredibly rapid drawing could possibly be. Oh, that's the wrong shade. That's a bit more correct. Alright, the answers are coming in now. This one is probably, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if you're going to be able to get it from this drawing. You might have to wait if you don't know. But if you do know, make sure that you answer right away because that's what's going to win you the most points in this quiz game of Pictionary. And uh, yeah, a few final details for those of you who are still not too sure. Maybe some little teeth. Maybe a little, a little coif. And um, I guess let's see what the answer is. It is of course, take it away Mod Acorn. Zulra. And congratulations, 1,052 of you who got that right. Unfortunately, 43 of you went with snake. That was probably the uh, the colour that made it a bit difficult there. But let's see what that does to our scores. Will we have another insane upset like question 12? So the person who answered this question the quickest was Groobsy with a perfect score of 200,000. 20,000, sorry. Congratulations, Groobsy. Has that launched you onto the leaderboard? Unfortunately not. We have Hamster Batchy holding on to that number one spot. Brunton absolutely flying into the number two spot. Peridot unfortunately slipped to the number four spot. Hamster Hat number three. And we have PD23 still on the leaderboard. A bit, a bit, a bit less of an upset this round, but we'll see if anybody else can, uh, can make it there or if these guys cling on all the way to the end and win themselves some membership. Okay, are we ready for drawing number 14? Let's do it. Right, what could this one be? I think we might have to get some, some answers in fairly quickly, just because I can't see very many people getting this one outrageously wrong. Answers coming in. What do you think it could be? Dragon Scimitar, Dragon Dagger, Dragon Longsword, or dragon sword. Do you recognize this very unique shape? What do you think it is? Right, 4,000 points if you answer now, but just as quickly, zero points if you answer now. What was the correct answer? Let's find out, Mod Acorn. Reveal it. It was, of course, the Dragon Longsword. A bit more of a split on the answers there. 135 guessing Dragon Sword and 192 guessing Dragon Scimitar. Of course, you know that the unique shape of the Scimitar is a bit more like that. So maybe you've learned something today. Let's see who answered those questions the best. Reveal the scores, please, Monothon. So, uh, coming in at the number one spot for answering that question, we have, ooh, Radamac, can't pronounce, with the top spot for the question, but we still have uh, some very familiar faces in the top five spots. We have Clevitar, back on with number five, PD23, number four, Peridot, number three, I think, back up from that number four spot. Brunton, we haven't seen you for a while, Brunton. Welcome back to our top 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 five. You're in second position. That is podium, my guy. And we have Hamsterbachi on number one. Let's see how our scores change. Moving on to question number, I think this is drawing number four, 15. Drawing number 15. Now, it's potentially 16. Who knows? Does it matter? We're having fun. Let's, uh, let's draw it. Right, this one I'm all too familiar with. What could it be? What could it be for question number 16? Who do you reckon it is? And remember, if you answer, if you answer too quickly, you lose your chance. So uh, take your time, make sure you're sure, because it's only the, uh, the correct answers that have a chance of winning that membership. I'm entertaining myself. If, not, if none of you are entertained, at least I am. <laughs> Who do you think it is? Oh no, I've done him like... 
There we go. Let's get him on stream. Ooh. Revealing the answers. Who could it be? Tiny little drum roll once again. It was, of course, the gnome child. And um, a couple of you guessed Goloff, but it seems like most of you did guess that one correctly. So congratulations to you guys. Let's see if you've won yourself um, a, a, a spot in our top five position. Um, scores on the doors, please, Mod Acon. Let's check it out. So the best answer for that question was Spearbomb13. Congratulations for your answer there. Very fast on the on on the question. Hamsterbatty in that number one spot, still looking very strong, but chased chased ever so ever so closely by Peridot into the number two spot from climbing back up from four three two. I think Peridot. PD23 in the number three spot, and we have the Liberate number four, and Serenthesis, that's a new name on our leaderboard. Congratulations, Serenthesis. You are in the fifth spot. Congratulations. Let's see if you can hold it. Let's see if you can climb it. Moving on to drawing number 17. Right. Obviously, all of these are iconic drawings, but uh, let's see. let's see how well you know them. <laughs> some some amazing drawing as well by moderator G. Professional artist, don't you know? Right, here come our answers. If you don't know, remember you're not gonna, you're not going to win any points. You're not going to win any points if you don't know. All right, what do you think, who, in fact, do you think this could possibly be? Oh. <laughs> Just a few little finishing details, um, but our timer is up, so we will see the answers. Oh my gosh, it's unfortunately a three-legged Bob the Cat. Three-legged Bob the Cat. We'll give him a third leg just for uh, just for the sake of uh, not giving us all absolute nightmares. T uh, 10 hundred of you getting that correct. Well done to you guys. Have any of you made it onto our leaderboard? The top answer comes from leaderboard reveal, tiny drum roll. I have a really itchy nose, I'm very sorry. I'm just gonna have to, Ooh, there we go. Okay, um, B Fazzle, congratulations with a perfect score there of 20,000. Consider me impressed. But on our top five, it's looking exactly the same. I don't think it's changed. It doesn't seem to have changed one bit, so congratulations to you guys. You are fighting very hard for that membership. I'm gonna hydrate. Mm. And Juno has just experienced some wind. <laughs> As in some wind came into the room and it's freaked her out because classic dog maneuvers. Um, and she's gone, but that's okay. We're gonna carry on with question number 18, I believe. Uh, Let's go. Sorry for that little inter interruption. I just got a bit confused by uh, the June there, launching herself out from behind me. Now, can you tell what this is already? Do you need a little bit more information? Well, here it is, if you needed it. As an absolutely incredible drawing, once again, by Moderator G Professional Artist. Uh, we've got some arms coming in. Oh, yeah, or, or are they arms? Who knows? You tell me. What do you think this is? So, um, to be honest, guys, it's all to play for at this point. You've got to make sure you're getting every point that you possibly can because we've only got two more questions. I think maybe we've only got, yeah, we've only got two more questions after this one to reach our full quota of 20 questions for this game of Pictionary. So, Let's see if we've got any new faces in our top five spots. It is all to play for. Oh my gosh, we only had 400 guessing rune plate body. I think that maybe the, the colours might have been slightly lost in translation there, guys. Adamant plate body coming in, but most of you guessed steel. I don't know if you can tell, but this is, of course, the classic blue shade of rune, and I am extremely sorry to the 600 odd of you that have got that wrong this could be an upset this could be an absolute upset lack of sanity getting a very quick answer in there 
but our top five spots Serenthesis launching himself into the third spot there. We have Kukel in number four, that is a new name. Noddle Cow in number fifth. And, um, but Hamster Batchy really hanging on to that top position. PD23 as well. Oh my gosh, we have lost, I believe, two members of our top five spot. This is an upset. This is dramatic. I'm shaking and slightly sweaty. How do you feel? Let's move into our second to last drawing. Are you ready? Pay attention to your colours this time, guys. And uh, <laughs> I'll make sure I make them as, uh, as recognisable as possible. What could this be? Do you have any idea? What could it be? Here come the answers. I hope we're not disconnecting again. <laughs> Are we disconnecting? Oh, no, we're not disconnecting. Okay, sorry, it must just be my end. Weird, wild. I've lost the stream. <laughs> okay. Sorry, guys, I'm just having a little bit of difficulty my end. But um, if you just give me two seconds to see where we are at. Oh, and an ad. <laughs> Okay, so um, our answer is, of course, an air rune. Congratulations to nearly all of you, I'm assured, got that right. I'll, I'll, know, I'll know for sure uh, when I see... Oh, there we go, I've got it back. Sorry, I just lost you guys. <laughs> okay, so let's see what that does to our scores. We will reveal them. I've got... My stream is lagging massively, I'm so sorry, guys. How are we doing? Can you see the the leaderboard? Because that's what it looks like. I can't see it, unfortunately. <laughs> Just... Any new names in the top five spot? Hamster Batchy still, still clawing onto number one. No new names in the top five spots. Well, we're going into the final drawing here. It's all to pay for. It's incredibly close. Will Hamster Batchy be taking away that one month of free membership? Oh, also, for those of you who are battling out for the top spot, um, if it comes up saying that you are in fact a winner, please make sure that you screenshot that image so that you can email it to us to prove that you are indeed the winner and we can send you the one month of free membership to the correct account. If you come in the top 10, but not the number one spot, please make sure that you screenshot your position as well and we'll make sure that you guys can get your seven day membership. So uh, anyone who's in the top five, you're looking pretty good. So it will ask you to submit an email address, just make sure that you're including all of the relevant information. Um, so we're moving now into our final drawing. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. What could it be? What could it be? Will Hamster Batchy take away that membership? Will somebody else swoop in at the last minute? Do you know what this drawing is already? Are you gonna get are you gonna get one of those top spots on the on the answer board? Seven days or potentially one month of free membership. Um so my stream is massive la massively lagging. Do we have any time left on the clock? Zero time left on the clock. Should we find out the correct answer? What was this absolutely shocking drawing that I think I potentially maybe drew off the screen, so let me just put it well into the screen. Over half of you got that one incorrect. It was, of course, the Armadil God Sword, this shocking drawing. Look, it has to be difficult somehow, and if the way that it's going to be slightly difficult is from some dodgy wonky drawings on my end, then I feel like I'm just doing a service. <laughs> But um, let's find out how that has affected our scores. Have we got scores revealed already? <laughs> PD23 
has swooped in at the very last minute. This is insane, guys. My, my top's honestly quite sweaty. Incredible moves by TPD23 at the absolute last minute to dethrone Hamster Batchy. Have we ever seen anything like it on Mod G Does Fictionary? I don't think we have. Incredible moves. Well done, PD Threat 23. Congratulations. Please make the most of your one month of free membership and all of the rest of you. Seven days for you. Massive congratulations. And thank you so much to anybody who played. I've had a good time. I hope that you've had a good time. I hope that you hate, don't hate me too much for some wonky drawings and strange colour choices. <laughs> But if you've enjoyed this, please let us know on any social media that you that you that you feel. Um, if you haven't enjoyed it, um, I don't know. Let us know as well. Perhaps with less violent words than you're originally thinking of picking. And um, I'll I'll see you guys very shortly. I'm sure. Uh, but as again, if you have enjoyed this, let us know. Um, winners, enjoy your free membership. Uh, is there anything else I have to add at the end of this live stream? People in my ear. I don't think so. Thanks for watching. Um, and make sure you check out Dead Man live on May the 1st. Well, have a